Hi, this is Mike Scramstead of CDOX and welcome to the tip of the day. Now in this tip we're going to talk a little bit about milling surgical guides in the Ceric Prime Mill. Now in the past there's many people that have been a little bit leery about milling surgical guides. They had some bad experiences, they've had some shavings clog up their milling chamber and just it kind of creates an overall mess. So one of the beauties of the Ceric Prime Mill is the whole internal was redesigned to maintain cleanliness. Now if you look at the inside of the Ceric Prime Mill, it almost looks brand new. This was one of the very first prime mills ever created. It's about 18 months old. I mill zirconia all day long and it almost looks brand new. Now at the bottom, that little screen that you can lift up, it seals perfectly around that drain. So when you mill surgical guides, nothing is going to get around it to clog up the milling chamber. So it's a very fast, efficient uh, process uh, and most importantly, does not create a mess and it's easy to clean up. Okay, so we'll go ahead and close uh, the milling chamber door. We'll begin the process of milling the surgical guide. It's going to take roughly uh, 25 minutes to mill a surgical guide in the Ceric Prime Mill. It's pretty fast and efficient. Now the most important thing is when we're done with this, you can see all the shavings were collected down in the bottom. I can remove the surgical guide. You can see that it milled out just fine. But most importantly, I can remove that screen and almost all the shavings are gonna come out with it. You can just dump it in the garbage and uh, the, you can see that really nothing is left behind. So it's a much more enjoyable process than it was uh, previously. Now you see just maybe a little bit of shavings here. What we're gonna do to alleviate that is we have cleaning cycles that are super fast to do. You wanna know why my milling unit is so clean with how much milling I do with it? It's because generally when I'm done doing surgical guides or after a day of zirconia, we go onto the touch screen and we just run a very, very quick cleaning cycle. Generally, I just run the two minute cleaning cycle and that's gonna be enough to keep it clean. So run that once a day and you'll never have to worry about a dirty milling chamber. So hopefully this process helps. Try milling surgical guides with a prime mill. Totally different experience and I think you're going to enjoy it. For more tips like this, please visit us at CDOCS. Thank you.